Today we're going to take a look at the best round to kill a hog or hunt a hog. Now, in Missouri, it is mandatory that if you're out hunting and you see a feral hog, you have to kill it. You don't have a choice. It would be against the law to let it live. And I think that's a great law because there are so many feral hogs in the Midwest, especially as you start heading south. So hogs is kind of a big problem in many states, in Missouri, in Arkansas, in Oklahoma, and especially in Texas. This is a huge issue. So we're going to take a look at what is the best round to kill a hog with. And we're going to start off by saying the best caliber is a 30 6 A 30 6 is the perfect hog killing bullet. The reason is you have 168 grains screaming out at upwards of 2,700 feet per second, giving the energy of about 2,500 pounds. The 30 6 is truly the best bullet to shoot a hog with. Now there's a lot of other bullets that'll certainly work, but if you're looking for the best, I highly recommend a 30 6 Now the specific brand of bullet and type of 30 6 that I'm gonna recommend is really two. I always recommend a Hornady bullet. Uh, when you're doing any kind of hunting or self-defense, I tend to always recommend Hornady. However, Remington makes an awesome bullet specifically designed for this task called the Hog Hammer. Now, oftentimes hog hunting can even be a very dangerous hunt. Um, a lot of people take hogs very lightly, a lot more lightly than they probably should because they could get pretty aggressive and pretty dangerous pretty quick. So the round has to take a real good shot every time for your safety. So I definitely recommend you don't go out there with just full metal jacket 30-06. If you're going to take it, take the hog hammer. You won't regret it. It'll be the one that takes that hog down. If you like this video, click like and subscribe. You can also now find us on Facebook under God, Family, and Guns. But the most important part of this YouTube channel is it is a ministry to us, and we take prayer requests, so please don't ever hesitate to send that stuff in. Thank you for watching this episode of God, Family, and Guns. And as always, love God, love your family, and love guns.